morning guys today is march 17th it's about six o'clock in the morning and i got something in the mail two days ago and it's this little guy and yesterday i thought about pulling out my camera several times and i actually did sometimes and then i turned it on and then i was like i don't even know what to say so today i'm just going for it because i feel like what happened yesterday is that I kind of, I was like, you know what, I'll just do it later. I'll just do it later. I'll just do it later. And that's kind of how I've been feeling this entire time since I started posting videos. And I kind of want to stop that and I want to start actually like doing what I say I'm going to do. Like in January, I had this big idea of... I had a schedule made, I had some videos planned, and then I never ended up committing to it. And I kind of want to put myself accountable for that. And so from now on, I want to start posting weekly vlogs. I want them to be posted every Friday. And I kind of want to do something that I've kind of never done or share something that will make the vlogs interesting and will make my life more interesting because I live the same week every single week. I go to school, I go to work, I go to the gym, I go to my boyfriend's house and my life's kind of just been like the same ever since I started this semester at school and I kind of want that to change because I'm not enjoying what I'm doing right now and so I want this to kind of just be like an outlet and an escape and something that I can do to make my life more interesting. And so that's why I bought this camera and that's why I wanted to start sharing my everyday life with you guys. Good morning puppies. This is Marley. Casey. Hey yo Casey. Carly. What's up? So I am currently in my car, as you can tell, and uh, I'm driving behind my mom because we're actually on our way to this paint and sip class. So what it is, is at one of our local outdoor malls, there's a class that people can take uh, for a really good amount, actually, and they can uh, be walked through uh, like a painting while also uh, like sipping on, a, I guess, a glass of wine. Uh, but it is 7.12 right now. Um, we still have a ways to go. This place is about uh, probably half hour to 45 minutes away from my house. So yeah, it'll be kind of a little bit of a drive, but it'll be fun and I will catch up with you guys a little later. <laughs> guys what's up today is March 21st and I am in my school parking lot I actually just got out of work and I'm just like I don't know I'm not really feeling good this week and I'm really tired and I don't really know uh, like what to do and I'm like I'm just like bored with my life and what what's going on right now I don't like living the same week every single week and I can't wait until it's not like that anymore uh, hopefully it'll not be like that sooner rather than later um, but yeah I'm kinda just in a funk today uh, I don't know really what I'm gonna do good morning guys today is Wednesday March 22nd and it's kinda just another day for me uh, I just have school and work and then I'm probably gonna go over to Tom's house for a little bit. Uh, I decided to do my makeup today because I haven't really been feeling good mentally all week and I haven't been doing my makeup and I haven't been trying to like look a little nicer uh, just because I haven't been feeling it but I felt like today if I just put on some makeup and tried to look nice that I'd feel better on the inside as well. So that's kind of just my motivation and 
hopefully after this week everything will start to get back on track good morning guys today is thursday march 23rd and i actually have to get going uh very very shortly but i just wanted to come over here uh in my bookcase and grab this one book this is the stay strong 365 days a year demi lovato uh number one new york times bestseller book and it kind of just has stuff for every day that uh you can look at and i love demi lovato i think she's a great inspiration especially for people who have gone or are going through uh what she's been through so i am just going to set this up here and i want to go to march 23rd and i kind of just like reading this every day just to uh see what this book has to say about um what you should like think about throughout the day and i don't do this every morning uh sometimes i forget and it's not or sometimes i just don't have time or anything like that but uh there's always just a short little uh paragraph that you can read and i really like it so i'm just going to read this for march 23rd it says never judge a book by its cover it's so easy to walk by people and make judgments about who they are based on small passing details or flaw that you've observed. Maybe their attitude appears to be rude. Maybe they aren't as outgoing as you are. Either way, without taking the time to actually get to know someone and hear what they've been through, you really have no right to judge anyone. The things we observe superficially are just that. They are false and impressions that don't tell you anything about what others have actually experienced and then there's a goal at the bottom and it says goal take the time to really get to know people ask them what their story is and be a good listener so that's just a little snippet of what this book is and i really like it i think that uh there's things in here that everybody can kind of learn something from or take advice of Hey guys, happy Friday. I know I didn't say anything in that last clip. Basically, Tom and I have been working on that puzzle for a couple weeks now and I just wanted to show you guys the progress of it because hopefully over spring break it'll be hopefully almost done. If not done, I think we're going to try to devote a lot of time to it because we've already been working on it for some time now and it's a thousand piece puzzle and I don't know why I chose this one first it was between this one I think another thousand piece puzzle and then a 750 piece puzzle and I don't know I just wanted to do uh, this Disney one because I just had vibes from Disney I miss Disney World I haven't been there in years uh, in January we were in Disneyland and that was awesome which is actually where my mom bought the puzzle and she bought it for me and Tom so I wanted to do it but I just wanted to end the vlog here because I need to get it up for you guys because it's Friday so thank you so much for watching please subscribe and I will see you next Friday